In this chilly corner of Northwest Ohio, unemployment tops 12%. The city feels raw. People in my own family haven't worked in over a year. My son uh, relocated to uh, Louisiana to find work, so. So that's the message Marcy Kaptur hears over and over. She thinks the administration doesn't get it. Within a week or two, of a presidency, you can reward Wall Street. You don't need to do any summit on that. Uh, and yet it's a year, and we can't put people back to work. An outspoken uh, Democrat who voted against TARP um, twice, she's lost confidence in the Obama economic team. I don't think he has the right generals. So should they go? I think they should. You could call the backlash over jobs economic populism, but in politics, that kind of anger can move or stop a policy. Witness the Wall Street overhaul. The Congressional Black Caucus, which includes some of the president's ardent supporters, blocked the bill from moving forward. Their complaint, not enough focus on jobs. And polls show Americans are far more concerned about jobs than even health care. That could steal some thunder from the president's top domestic priority. I believe it is possible that House members in particular, all of whom are up for re-election next November, are going to insist that the economy, in particular job creation, be the highest priority. That means look for Congress to push for a jobs bill now, even if the White House is still in summit mode. Lizzie O'Leary, Bloomberg News.